Welcome back to Roshnara's world. So guys, today's video, we will be talking about the entire selection process of Wipro company. So now Wipro hires for both freshers and experienced uh, candidates. We will be specially talking about the fresher candidates here. So Wipro basically, you know, hires people uh, on campus recruitment also and off cam uh, campus recruitment also. So for both the, uh, you know, um, hiring process, we, uh, the process is quite similar in both the, uh, you know, hiring process. Processes. So now we'll be talking about um, the first uh, step, which is the online test. Now the online test consists of basically five uh, topics, which is quantitative aptitude, your reasoning, your verbal, uh, then your uh, uh, basic programming and computer skills. And the last one is essay type question. Okay, so these are the five uh, basic, uh, you know, topics where you will be getting questions and this question, these questions will be, you know, based on AMCAT, uh, uh, you know, uh, pattern. So now what is AMCAT? You might have heard about AMCAT, that uh, AMCAT conducts, uh, you know, online tests for various companies. So similarly, it conducts, it conducts for Wipro as well. So now um, AMCAT, what happens is uh, you, uh, you know, mark uh, correct answers. So slowly and gradually your next question uh, you know difficulty level might increase according to your previous questions uh, the pattern of the uh, previous questions your next question will be uh, based on that so this is how you can you know prepare yourself about amcat you can practice uh, you know questions from amcat's website and you know they have some subscriptions and all but you can just do it for free also you will be getting questions just google it okay now uh, talking about the uh, this uh, basic programming and computer skills wala uh, part in this uh, you know you will be getting two type of quite coding questions now one can be a bit easy uh, you know level and the second question can be a moderate or a high level question okay depending upon uh, the uh, coding question you will be getting approximately 45 minutes and you need to uh, you know answer that questions now um, moving ahead to the essay type question so in essay type questions you will be getting basically you'll get get a topic and you need to write uh, an essay about that topic that topic can be you know mostly related to uh, current affairs or political affairs and you need to write uh, that particular uh, you know about that essay now the next step is technical round now technical round obviously you will be asked about yourself and then uh, you know about your projects and everything what you have done in past um, so now uh, when you tell your about your projects uh, in the uh, technical round they will be asking you know technical questions about your pro uh, pro this uh, project so now it's very important that you should be well -worked with your projects and everything you should know each and matlab, you should know deeply about your projects right then um, it, 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 uh, there could be a question about Java C++ or you know DBMS uh, it can be about data warehouses reverse link uh, list and then uh, uh, computer networking uh, operating system and these are the very basic uh, things so you need to prepare about it these are the few topics i have given you uh, most of the questions are from these topics but yes you need to um, be more uh, prepared and you just uh, you know uh, search about more topics and very well versed with your uh, coding and this technical part so the final round is guys the hr round now in the hr round the hr might ask you about yourself and then after uh, you know you uh, tell them about yourself they can ask you why you want to join wipro so the, the question and the confidence le level should be very high so that they can you know actually hire you based on these type of you know conversation and then they can ask you about uh, also, there is there, there, there might be a question where they can ask you any questions for interviewer, okay, for NHR. So please, uh, you know, uh, don't uh, be like this. You know, I don't have a question. You should have one question at least for the HR, okay. That can be related to your further steps, your further, you know, recruitment uh, process or anything. Just a basic question you should keep about NHR, right? That actually shows that you are keen and you are interested uh, in the process, and um, it's um, so it they feel good about you know uh, it's a positive uh, you know point that you ask questions uh, from the HR okay uh, so this is the HR round also there can be a GD round which is group discussion now uh, in the group 
group discussion there again can be a topic and you need to speak about it so sometimes they do conduct uh, you know gd and sometimes they do not conduct so that totally depends upon them how do they want to you know conduct the uh, process but yes there are three rounds one is online test and uh, which i told you about the uh, technical round and the third one is the hr round so these are the four uh, three steps and you need to prepare about it and when you are being selected they contact you over email or calls that you are being uh, selected and they will be asking you for the joining this was the entire process of a pros uh, selection process interview process and yes uh, i hope you like this video and it was informative do share with your friends and yes uh, there are few modes that uh, you can apply for wipro uh, those modes can be you know direct career pages from wipro's uh, you know website i'll give you the link in the description box don't worry and yes the other is linkedin linkedin is quite safer from other platforms and there are other platforms like nokri.com and all also you can you know uh, prefer that also but yes i'll uh, from my end uh, i'll suggest you the best is the website of wipro okay so and also guys uh, make sure that uh, you don't end up giving any sort of money to anyone that uh, will get you a job or something like that that can be scam so be aware of that also and uh, do share with your friends i hope you like this and do subscribe the channel for more content and do let me know in case you want me to create videos for you uh, for any particular topic do let me know thank you so much guys have a great day be safe take care bye